Hello, bud. What are you doing down here? Oh, hello. Just going for a ball and chalk. You ain't busy, so I've left Grady in charge of the shop. Here, you look glum. What's up? Don't ask, but don't ask. Well, I have, and I. Come on, Harry, what's up? Well, I'm sorry to say this, but I think I'm going brassic. Brassic? No, not you, Harry. What makes you think that? You see, but I done a bundle on them branches Christmas trees. You mean broomhandles, don't you? <laughs> don't rub it in, but yes, I got a warehouse full of them, but it's not them. It's the revenues. They think they're me business partners, and that lost me a fifteen grand in taxes. If I ain't give him that, I'll go skint. And what's more, Big Stan is looking for me. I'm not sure, but I think I owe him a couple of grand. A couple of grand? Blimey! What are you going to do? Hang on, Harry. I've got an idea for the revenues. You know that if you ask them, they sometimes take scoops instead of dough. Why not give it a go? And don't worry about Big Stan. If he comes round here, I'll say that I haven't seen him for ages. Thanks, Bert, but the revenues. Mind you, that's a good idea of yours. Only, I haven't got too many good things around this time of the year. Oh, yes, you have. Brum handles. Now, everyone needs brum handles. Why not offer them short flagpoles for Union Tax? Tell them that they're unique and will be supporting the British Union Jack Flag Company. Hmm. Sounds a good idea. You know what, Bert? I will give it a go. No nothing, Larry. Nothing ventured, nothing gained. A couple of weeks later. Morning, Bert. Morning, Larry. You're looking chipper today. I haven't seen you for a while. Well, how have you been getting on? All right, all right. Big Stan caught up with me down at the wash name. But he never wanted any dosh from me. Nah. <coughs> Excuse me. He apologised and because we do a lot of business together, said that he made a mistake by well overpricing some ladies' designer handbags like and I bought, and he gave me back two grand instead. That went straight into me old grind, me old sky rocket. Yeah, that's a turn up for the book. There will win there, Harry. Yeah, and the revenuers not only took all the broom handles I had instead of the cash, but they even sent me back thirty-five handles as a tax rebate. Happy days, Bert. Oh, happy days. Does this mean that there's a chance that you're going to clean the slate then? It's only 15 quid. Slate? Uh, 15 quid, Bert. Oh, uh, sorry, Bert. Uh, I can't hear you. Uh, I'm off to... S uh, my bus is coming. I'll see you later. Oh, another 15 quid up this morning. But there you go. That's usually the way it is with Harry Geezer. You win one occasionally, but usually you lose a lot. <sighs> Next customer, please. We have been advised to inform you that Barassic is short for Barassic Lint. That means skint or going broke. A ball of chalk means walk, and a sky rocket is a pocket.